Okay guys, I just wanted to make a um, quick video on showing you the best $20 you can spend if you have a, um, a Jeep Cherokee or if you're just a car enthusiast. The best $20 you can spend is on a little program for Android phones or iPhones um, called Torque Pro. Um, it's five dollars from the Google Play Store. They have a Torque Lite, but I recommend just spending the five dollars and getting the Torque Pro. Um, this program shows you live diagnostic information, and it also lets you clear check engine codes and um, read check engine codes so you can diagnose problems. So the app is five dollars in the Google Play Store, but then you're also going to need one of these OBD2 adapters. I got mine from eBay. Um, they have this kind, which is a little bit bigger, and they also have um, they have one that's like a transparent blue color. But I don't recommend getting one of those because um, I've had two of them and neither of them worked. The transparent blue ones are. Uh, a little bit cheaper I think they were like two dollars a piece this one was a little bit more expensive it was about thirteen dollars but like I said the blue ones never worked so I should have just gotten the one that was a little bit more expensive from the beginning so the app was five dollars and this was thirteen dollars with free shipping so in all I have eighteen dollars into this and just to give you an example of some of the things you can do I'm gonna show you right now I'm gonna um I had a faulty coolant temperature sensor which I just replaced with a Mopar one so um, it did throw a check engine light because it wasn't reading um, the right coolant temperature it was at zero so I'm just gonna show you guys how we can clear we can look at check engine codes using the torque app so the first thing I'm gonna do is with the engine off I'm gonna plug this into the OBD2 port right down here and you can't really see it from here, but um, when you plug it in and the engine turns on, um, it, it lights up to let you know that it's getting power. Um, so I'm going to turn on the engine. So you guys can see, let me shut off the AC. Okay, so as soon as I um, turned on the engine, a um, request came up on my phone to um, pair the device. Maybe. Bluetooth device is connecting. We might have to just restart the key cycle again since my Bluetooth wasn't turned on on the phone. Sometimes it takes a minute when I have to reopen the app. Okay, so it says defaulting to paired OBT2 device. And now you can see it's communicating with the car's PCM when that little car icon pops up. So now we're connected to the car's PCM. As you can see, the check engine light's on. So we'll uh, go over here to fault codes. And uh, it gives you a prompt to search for any codes that are popped up. And we did get two codes. Um, so right here we'll click on this one. And uh, the fault code as you can see is P0118 and it says engine coolant temperature circuit high output. So that was the one that we just replaced. So to clear the code, I'm going to come up here and it gives you a list and as you can see right here at the top it says clear fault codes on ECU and we can watch as the check engine light goes off, click OK and the check engine light went off. 
so now we just cleared the code we'll start the Jeep back up and as you can see our coolant temperature is reading as normal and now we don't have any codes so the other thing that this app does is um, it also lets you read real-time information so now that we have a connection to the ECU, you can see we have um, throttle position, vacuum, um, the coolant temperature, and um, we have RPMs up here. And it also has a speedometer. So you can get real-time information on this. And it also records and um, does some graphing, which I'm going to make a video on later. So uh, thanks for watching, guys. And uh, please like and subscribe. I'm going to be doing some more Jeep updates pretty soon. I'm um, doing an oil change. Uh, i got to do a couple differential services, um, things like that. So I'll be posting more Jeep videos. Uh, thanks for watching. Please subscribe.